was a hot morning in the city. Rosie and Tim were going off to their piano lessons. When, all of a sudden, they saw a huge box right outside their apartments. They became very curious. Is that your box? No, I thought it was yours. What on earth can it be? Where could it come from? Look! It has my name and address on it. Shall we open it? Yeah. Inside the box was the biggest surprise of Rosie's life. climbed out of the box and looked around. Who are you? Where have you come from? My name is Max and I come from the magic jungle. The magic jungle. Why, oh, why did I end up here? Please, can you help me? I've got to get back to the jungle, the magic jungle. Yes, jungle! The magic jungle. I can hear a two can. I wonder if you can. I can hear a flu. There's a toucan trilling on a flute. The box landed in the jungle. Tim, Rosie and Max climbed out. Jackets. Jogging in the jungle, you know what that means. Put on your jacket, your jumper, and your jeans. Jogging in the jungle. Jogging in the jungle. Jogging in the jungle. Oh, oh, oh. Jogging in the jungle. You know what that means. Wearing our jeans. Wearing our jeans. Wearing our jeans. Jogging in the jungle. You know what that means. Put on your jacket. You jump around your jeans. This is my family tree And this is my father He's happy to welcome us home I've been all around the world In a brown paper box But this is where I belong love to play the clarinet. We monkeys play violin, giraffes play viola, and baboons play bassoon. Bassoon? What does that sound like? Can we listen to them both? was quite clear. Rosie didn't want to be an elephant. And although she thought the bassoon sounded absolutely brilliant, she didn't want to be a baboon either. 
Shun, please. Away, the crocodile in the swamp woke up and began to play the saxophone. It was so sunny, he put his sunglasses on. He looked very cool. Crocodile rush. Put a smile on your face. You can't feel sad when you pop your worries in a crocodile bag and snap. Crocodile snap. Snap, snap, crocodile. Snap, snap, crocodile. Snap to the crocodile rush. The crocodile rush. It was becoming clearer. This was no ordinary, typical jungle. These were not the animals you've seen in the zoo. It was a magical, musical jungle. By listening very carefully, Rosie and Tim began to appreciate the unique sounds of all the instruments. Some were high pitched. Some were low pitched. Some were blown. Some were bowed. Some were plucked. And some were rolled. Some were soft. And some were loud. But what were the two? Play. Oh yes, they were playing violas, resting on their shoulders. Snake, get ready to jump out of your skin. We're coming to see you. As they were walking to the place where the snake lived, the sky grew darker. Dark. It started to rain. Then they saw the snake. Said the snake, "I'm here to frighten you. Go away. No. Why are you here?" Storm began. 